is, is reeling tonight after a tough day at the Capitol. Good evening, I'm Daniel Wynn. And I'm Dana Clemens. Missouri's auditor this morning released a scathing report saying the department misspent more than $1 million of state that was supposed to go to the early childhood education and instead spent it on salaries. And late this afternoon at a hearing in the Capitol, questions continued about the department's inability to process Medicaid claims. And that's a story we've been telling you about since last fall. ABC 17's Ashley Strohmeyer has been reporting on this, and she's at the Capitol tonight. And Ashley, uh, DSS provided some answers tonight and blamed the system as a whole. Daniel, today, Allison Campbell, one of the directors at Social Services, updated lawmakers on how the department is doing. A lot of what has been said is very redundant because along with the new session, the Speaker of the House appointed new committee members. Now, Campbell tells lawmakers if someone needs help with eligibility or any new, new provided by social services, they could contact the call center. She says the department has implemented something called first responders. Now, this means if someone at the call center can't help solve a problem, they send them directly to an eligibility specialist. However, Campbell says this system is not 100 percent just yet. The biggest issue social services is working with is the call center on its customer service. Campbell gave her explanation as to why there have been not one but two glitches in the social in the Department of Social Services system. We were building it as we were using it, just a horrible way to implement the system, but that's what we did. We are continuing to look at it, and it's something that we, again, I look at it every day. I look at the numbers every day. Campbell also said they will be meeting with the president of Young Williams, which is the contractor call center at Social Services. She says they will be discussing if they want to renew their contract with them. Live at the state capitol, Ashley Strohmeyer, ABC 17 News. Thank you very much, Ashley. And like we said, DSS is also under fire for using its money poorly. State Auditor Tom Schweik says over a million dollars at the Department of Social Services meant to go to kids went into officials' paychecks. The audit shows the department let contractors boost their salaries for seven months instead of serving more families in the government-funded Head Start programs. So we found over a million and a half dollars that did not go to kids but went to bureaucrats instead. That for the amount of money they were being paid, the contractors should have been handling about 580 families and they were handling 240 families instead. Tom Schweik also said there's not enough on-site monitoring of contractors with social services to make sure they're actually providing services.